to Ningen Farms in the central wheat belt of Western Australia. Now it's time to get back into some cracking farming. Hey, welcome back to Duck Solid Gaming and Ningen Farm. That's right, we are back continuing on with our huge harvest here at Ningen Farm. And uh, as we're losing daylight, uh, we are just going to continue plowing on through, pardon any pun, uh, with the work we've got here waiting for us because um, we are exceptionally busy at the moment. Uh, lots of things going on, lots of things going wrong with our AI, um, our, our hired hands just not doing what they've been told to do, or they just decide to get trapped on things, which we've got to go rescue the new Holland in a second. Um, but we're going to offload this load of corn first, and here we go. So we're going to do that. We're going to go off and see what's going on. So our new Holland combines got stuck in trees yet again. This guy's running out of fuel. Uh, what else we have going on? You've been stuck here on a bloody fence. Right. So what we're going to do is we're going to stop drive up. We're going to bring you back a little bit. Don't know why you got stuck on that fence anyway. But, needless to say, you did. Uh, we're going to bring him round. Hopefully we can bring him round tight enough. We've got caught in that fence here. He's going to get caught in this fence here. We're just going to fold up. That'll mean we can get around. Okay. See him here, and we should be able to drive course and be pretty close to where we need to be. He's going to unload, so he should be okay now. Um, 5,000 is very fueled. Uh, you need to be unloaded, right? I'm crying out loud, seriously, guys. You know what? It's just going to be easier. So I'm going to stop this driver, pull you out. This is what happens. So even on a small field, where you think that you don't need to have um, two or three header rows, you obviously do because the even the course play AI or course play programming um, is much better than the AI in game. Uh, it still isn't perfect, and um, it's just easier sometimes to do it manually. That's what we're going to do. We're going to finish off this field manually and, uh, and then we'll be, be damned. We'll, we'll be done with this one and then we can move him on to uh, the next field over, field 11. And then uh, we won't hopefully have as many problems over on field 11 as what we're having on this field. But I don't like my chances. Right. And away we go. We'll get this combine loaded, clear the field, and then uh, hopefully we might be able to find a space in the trees to get this through with the header on, and we're having to take it off, but I don't like my chances. Anyway, I hope everyone is doing well. We are progressing on and through. Let me just have a look at something very, very quickly. I'm just going to hold tab out. I just want to check the schedule to see when this video is going to be going live. This video will be live just prior to New Year's Eve. Um, I think probably about the 30th of December this will be um, this will be live. So I hope everyone's had a Merry Christmas and all that sort of stuff. Uh, and enjoy some time with family, friends, all that sort of uh, normal thing for this time of year. I uh, hope everyone is still staying safe. I mean, we've still got COVID, obviously, as we have the last two years going through the world. Um, but hopefully you and your family are... Uh, looking after yourselves and uh, spending time with family and friends at this point in time and just having a good old break. That's certainly what we are looking forward to. Uh, we start our break uh, next, next couple of days, I'll finish work and then um, we'll be looking forward to, there's another light we had, there we go. Uh, we'll be looking forward to having that break as well. We come down here, we're going to offload. Once I've uploaded this guy, I might fast forward to daylight. Mm. The other units that are still running, I'll just leave them running for me. So the other combine needs to be offloaded, so we might offload him as well. There we go, so he's offloaded. So we can now... Yeah. Right, so I can go up here. I'm going to actually go... To... In fact, no, I'm going to leave. I'm going to wait until daylight. So, 
We are going to fast forward. They're doing anything else. Just going to fast forward. I'm not going to go to the farm uh, farm house or anything else like that. Uh, while we're fast forwarding, I need to have a look. Oh, oh piggies are in trouble. Um, we might lose some piggies. Uh, oh, maybe I haven't lost. Uh, no, I lost. Look at that. I lost piggies. I knew I should have looked after some animals. Damn it. All right, so 85 animals have died. Um, not not good. Although we've got plenty of animals, so it's just, yeah, it's just not good. Right, so certainly with the pigs, we need to, to get them up and running. So we'll have to do that this episode. Um, yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know. What happens here at Ducks Early Gaming, we, we look after our farms and kill our animals. And not necessarily on purpose. Right, uh, I'm just not going to get into there with that header, am I? Right, I'm going to come back to that one. I'm going to deal with everything else first. I've got some bales uh, to bring in. Um, the Lexan needs to be unloaded again, so I can take this around and get him offloaded straight away. So that. Let's do the easy jobs. So the basin of this trailer, so I can go and pick the uh, pigs up. Um, they, can, they can last a few more minutes. What's the worst that happened? Kill up, kill up another 85 of them? Jesus. Right. <laughs> there are class combines up here waiting patiently. He hasn't got a lot more to do here on this field. So, um, we'll get that done and out of the way. And then, uh, move on to the other field with the corn. And then, uh, we'll be close to being complete. Right. So, you know, Fill you up, fill you up. You're no longer needed here, so engine's still running, but you can um, head back up. We can offload this guy. We don't need him. Actually, no, we don't. We can wait because he's going to be doing this field as well, isn't he? So uh, let's just bring him over here. We'll have him sitting here by the side of the field, ready to go. Okay. So we might as well get this combine running. I know we said we weren't going to, but let's just do it anyway. So we'll jump out. Take off the header. Right, so let's um, unfold our header. Lower, disconnect. Now, what we're going to do, instead of trying to go in there and maneuver around the way I normally well, geez, just one of those days, isn't it? <laughs> right. We don't edit things out here at Dark Solar Gaming. You see the good, the bad, and the ugly. And you see the bad and the ugly more often than the good, so it's all good. Right, connect that up. What I'm going to do is I'm going to squeeze through past the truck. I've got my header ready to go. It doesn't really matter if I squeeze past the truck here or not. I can go the other way. Um, come through here. Hopefully we don't get caught in those branches. Bring the header up. Got that little bit of crop there. Hopefully that's enough. About there. Hopefully that gives me enough to get out. Right, so we're going to disconnect the header. We're going to swing into there like that. Run over the header bar. Get off it. Oh, it's that little sapling. Damn it. Right. <laughs> what a mess. Damn sapling. Who put that sapling there? I mean, seriously. Next job on the list is to get rid of the sapling. Right. I made that a lot harder than what it was meant to be. go. Right. Hold that up. Right. Okay. Let's try this again. So what we're going to do now is we're going to set up a course. Now make sure we've got two header rows. Course generation. Build 14 around two header rows 
Um, and that should be so fine. No. What did you do that for? Put 11. There we go. That's better. Um, oh, I'll just leave it. That'll be fine. I'm not going to worry about mucking about. Right, off you go. Right, leave. Now, uh, I'm going to grab the truck. Uh, oh, the other one needs to be unloaded. So we need to grab the challenger. Let's go find our challenger. There he is. We need to go offload the New Holland. What a mess, what a mess, what a mess. Anyway, 10 minutes in and we've had nothing but disasters. Let's uh, see if we can recover. So we've got this guy here, we should have to offload him in at least another once. Yeah, probably once, once more. Um, offload him now. We can continue, so we're just gonna leave that to there. All good. You're almost finished, seemingly, which is good. So we can then move you onto the new field as well. You're doing catatonic turns. I don't want to look at you. All right. We're going to go grab some more of our straw off field two. We need to finish moving everything off field two. And besides which, what can go wrong with picking up some straw bales? I don't know. Other than the fact we're using an auto loader, nothing should go wrong. All right. Get on down. Pick them up. Hopefully these wonderful trailers we had from JFL uh, will be available very, very soon in FS22. Um, my, my most favoured trailers in FS19. Um, hopefully will be available very, very soon in FS22. Now, I'm, at, I, I'm trying not to mention FS22 too much while we're playing FS19, but I uh, can't help that. Back to the life that uh, this, is, this is obviously going to have a very short shelf life. Uh, the rest of these videos and in fact they're probably not getting as much views in a way that they would have previously because of the fact that we've we've all transitioned pretty much to fs22 um and and certainly thus far it's been a good successor so um i i get that but uh just for the fact of having content available um we are continuing to provide at least two series on fs19 so um it gives you some content to watch and i've just Totally botched that up. So what could go wrong? Well, I could just cock up the driving and just turn too early, which is exactly what we did there. Right, now, so we are going to set up our auto load. Now done, turn around, we're gonna auto load all these bales on. Now, I think I'm going to come back for a little load of some more once I get these on. Trailer full. We missed one. Missed one. Right, go back around. We'll collect that one more. And yeah, we've got just what seven bales or something to collect when we come back. There we go. We've got a fully laden truck now, so we're gonna take this back to the farm, and then we'll worry about coming back and collecting them a little bit later. Right, uh, Zero needs to be refueled, yet we know that. Two combines need to be unloaded, fine. And our New Holland that was doing the bowing has finished as well, that's fine. Right, we might bring the fuel over to the Zerion. We've got a fuel trailer there somewhere, we'll bring that over and we'll refuel him uh, before he runs out of fuel entirely and we'll then, we'll then send the New Holland to another field to start bowing in and uh, just move things along that way. All right, let's go wet the whistle. Oh, 
All right. It's hard to believe we're coming into 2022 already. It's um, quite reports and by all, all the things that have happened this year, and certainly like last year, it's been a, a pretty crappy year. Uh, but it has gone so quickly. Um, certainly from a from a work perspective, um, it has just been a crazy year for myself. Um, but it has just gone so quick, it's not funny. Um, it was only like yesterday, it was in May, and I was um, busy setting up a new office and doing the project management and all that, and now we're, we've gone full circle, we're, we're way past that. Anyway, um, yeah, just bizarre. Anyway, okay, we're going to offload our bales here. Uh, uh, we're going to go to this second shed now. But we had two sheds for hay bales. Uh, so we're going to stack our second trailer. Unload point there. And we're going to unload. There we go. And our third trailer will bring in. Go. There we go, and offload, and we have a couple of trailers out there, but that's okay. What we'll do is we'll just um, knock them back into place in a second. They will actually come back through. We'll use the truck to do it, why not? Just give them a bit of a nudge. Only just, see, only just fractionally out. All right, that's all well and good. Park the trailers in the truck now. And then we can move back into looking after our fields and getting all that started. Um, obviously we haven't started seeding as such as yet. Um, I'm going to have to have a look and see what we're looking at for profiles. Uh, I'm going to bring these trailers in here. I'm going to bring them out too fast, that'll be fine. Okay, let's have a look and see. Um, Okay, what I want to do is I want to get that uh, I want to get this guy here offloaded or finish him off and then we can get back and go fix our animals up so that's probably the biggest thing we need to do next uh, I'm going to need to go sort out our piggies so we'll load this this load up now uh, and then I'll go and deal with the pigs directly that's what we'll do next the rest of the stuff can just sort of wait for a few minutes until we, we've done that I think we'll just make sure we don't want to get any more deaths of animals. Otherwise, Peter will be on our back. One more load to go uh, when the combine's finished in that field, uh, and then we well, at least this field, and then we have one more field to go with corn. Uh, but like I said, I think we'll be doing a little bit more corn in the next, uh, next rotation. In fact, I must look at my rotations. I don't know if I've set rotations up, so I need to have a look at that as well. Uh, but anyway, we're going to come in here, play our corn. And then I'm going to go grab some pig food and we're going to go sort out those. Uh, I don't need this trailer, do I? I? Do you have a smaller trailer somewhere? Where's that? Um, look, not here. Uh, no, I've got to put all this stuff away too. Uh, yeah. No, I thought I had a smaller trailer. I really did. But anyway, seemingly not. It's okay. Oh, he's finished, which is fine. So what we can do is we can just stop him. Uh, removes that from the view. Uh, you're finished as well. Um, okay, well, seeing as you're finished, what we're going to do is I'm going to stop the driver. I'm not going to worry about loading into the overloader. I'm just going to go and load directly into the truck. And at least this guy then is also finished. Okay, 
so he's finished there so we can uh, pipe in bring him off back onto the field here okay we're going to turn you off All right so we can set him up again in a minute and yet again you've decided to do what Right, you're doing combine self-unloading, so that's my fault. Okay, no worries. I get it. Alright, so we're going to fix him up. Right, what we're going to do is I'm going to pipe out, grab the truck, offload, and then I'll send him back to where he should be. I thought I turned it off before, but anyway. That was the other combine, wasn't it? Alright. Okay, he's offloaded that now. Oh, get around. Okay. Uh current waypoint, drive course. He should head back to where he was currently set up to be. And uh, you leave him there. Now what was I doing? Right, this guy. Big food, let's go. Let's sort these piggies out. Another trailer up near the pigs. There might be a trailer up there actually. Uh, uh, we're going to go pig food. Here we go. Uh, hello. Um, okay. That's very interesting. Why is that not working? Hmm. Seems like we've got a bit of a bug again with our silo. Um, right. Very interesting indeed. Definitely nothing in the trailer. Let's see what's going on with that. We don't need this sort of stuff going on. But anyway, I don't, I don't know why doing that. There we go. But anyway, we're going to come up here. We do have another trailer up here, so I'm going to use that trailer instead. I'm going to bring this here. Let's um, just get the trailer. I'm going to clean up this mess for a start. Clean up that, clean up the sheep as well while we're here. Right, we've got to grab this trailer and then we'll see if we can get that silo working. Uh, actually, before I do that, where I forget. And water going for both of these. Alright, so both got water now. Right, grab this trailer and we'll go see what we can sort out. He's still got some straw in there, which is fine, so that'll, that'll help fill up our straw, so that's good. That's, um, Right, so it won't be, won't be the maximum we need in there, but that's okay, it was a little bit more. I'm going to go see if I can get some heat food or anything, or anything for that matter out of the silo. Alright, 
these things are meant to test us, but I don't know why this is all of a sudden just playing up. It did happen once before, if you remember correctly. Um, just didn't want to load for whatever reason for a particular trailer. Um, go back to the food. Okay, so the silo itself does not want to unload anything at all. Um, hmm. Right, I don't know why that's doing that. But anyway, we will leave that for the next episode. I think we, what we'll do is we'll, uh, we'll fix the pigs. Uh, in an, I'm just going to slow down time so I don't want to rough that up entirely. We'll come back and do that a little bit later. Um, where are you at? You're, oh, you're still going okay with you. So I'll probably leave you for now. We need to offload this guy. Oh, actually, no, what we need to do is offload the overloader first. And offload this into the truck and we'll go offload the truck into the silo. Um, although do I really want to put anything in the silo because there's a silo, well the silo is accepting stuff, it's just not offloading stuff. Um, hopefully a reboot of the game will fix that as it has done previously. Um, if I can't offload out of the silo then that becomes a huge problem for us. It may well be the death of this series, in fact. To be perfectly honest. I reckon it's going to be, yeah, 5,000 litres has to go in the second trial. Pull that out. New. Go off and offload. I'm going to see if I can manage to get my way around through here. I'm going to see if I can thread the needle. See how good my road train skills are still to get him around tight bends and stuff without getting caught. Piece of cake. Let's have a look. Is that actually? Uh, yeah, it's going in the silo. Okay, we just can't pull it out for some reason. But anyway, so we got we got almost a million canola in there. We've got plenty of stuff we can be selling. But I tell you what, if we can't pull it out of the silo, then we can't sell it, can we? Right, bring the truck up. We'll put it in the middle of the yard for now. Bring it up, we'll just park it next to this guy like here. In fact, no, we'll put bring it in here for now. This well and truly out of the way. Okay. Leave you there. Uh, the lexia needs to be unloaded. It's good. Um Right, I don't know what else we need to do, really. Um Right, you can go uh, and play. Oh, we got straw over there to collect. You know what? I can't be bothered. We will just go over here, and I'm going to manually play this in. Finish off the episode because I can't trust my AI. <laughs> I do. Is my is my skill set any better? Let's see. Unfold. Get rid of that. Like I said, we'll just finish this episode off. Uh, which we're going to sign off basically now because we've run out of time um, and hopefully and between now and the next episode we can uh, fix our silo because if we can't fix our silo um, then yeah it will be the death of the series quite literally because um well we can't do anything else with it so i mean i could put a new silo system in get that working fill it up with the, the appropriate amount of um 
of stock we've currently got in our silo, but um, is it is it worth the hassle? Probably not, because um, like I said, this is not going to last forever. These series on FS19, so it may just be the time to cut it away. So um, we'll have to see. Uh, if you don't see another episode of Ningen Farms, and I will post on the community um, announcements. Um, but if you don't see another episode of Ningen Farm, then you know what's happened. But uh, but hopefully we will be back with Ningen Farm. Uh, we'll have to wait and see what we work out and fix. But apart from anything else, I hope you've liked the episode. I hope you like the series, just in case it's not the uh, not going to continue. Uh, and if you did, make sure you press that like button. And also, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing. Uh, press that subscribe button and press the alarm notification icon as well, so you can be made aware of when new videos are available on the channel. And, of course, don't forget to come and join us on Twitch, Twitter, Discord, and Facebook. Details of all those down below. As to as the details on how you can support the channel financially, if you so desire as well, which is not expected, but would be greatly appreciated, because there are obviously costs involved and all that sort of stuff. Um, but apart from that, uh, most importantly, take care of yourself and your loved ones, and we'll see you again very, very soon back here at Duck Solar Gaming, and perhaps back here on Ningen Farm. Thanks so much for watching. See you all later. Bye.